Before my diagnosis, I was a mom, a mother of two sons, one in college, one in high school, um, busy with their activities, uh, busy with work. I went for a mammogram, uh, as I did every year since I was 29, and they said, something looks different, but we don't think it's cancer. We think maybe it's just aging, but we'd like to run some more tests. And after three or four more tests, they finally ran a biopsy, and I knew it was cancer when I got a call that said, you need to come into the office tomorrow no matter what. After I was presented with my options for dealing with my breast cancer, I knew pretty quickly that I wanted to have a uh, double mastectomy with uh, breast reconstruction. A breast reconstruction candidate is faced with a lot of options, from implants, to flaps, to fat grafting, to expanders. After I met with the plastic surgeon, I felt very confident in her abilities and felt I knew exactly where I stood and I was confident that I would have good results. My plastic surgeon and I joke all the time because the joking makes it so much easier. Like she said, oh, I can't make you as big as you were, but they'll be perky. And I was like, as long as they come with attitude, that's all I care about. <laughs> I'm thrilled with the results of the uh, breast reconstruction I had done. I feel great. I have been mountain climbing, hiking, jumping out of airplanes, and traveling internationally. You no longer feel like a victim. You don't feel like you have cancer. You don't feel like cancer has you. I'm grateful that when I see myself every day, especially when I'm dressed, I look exactly the same, you know? Actually, I look better, so.